I'm Ariana Lee, continuing our coverage now on a situation we've been tracking for years. We checked on the Brown Street underpass in July 2017, then again last week. Each time we find a homeless camp with people in tents blocking the walkways. Today was different though. Crews cleared out the camp and several bright orange pieces of paper are taped to the walls of the Brown Street underpass. This isn't the first time the city's cleaned it up. They say they do it once every week. However, this is the first time we've seen a notice to remove property. The underpass has been a problem area in the city for years and it's only gotten more dangerous. Downtown Spokane Partnership, one of the agencies cleaning it up every week, says they can only clean once a week because they won't go into the area without police. The organization says they've dealt with people not cooperating. They've also seen drug use and violence in that underpass. According to the notice, people in the underpass have until Sunday at 10 10 in the morning to remove all their belongings. If they don't, the city will consider it abandoned and get rid of it. Reporting in studio, I'm Ariana Lake, KXLY4 News.